Oh, I can, I can sniff your butt. Ouch. Okay, won't sniff your butt. Fine, see if I care. What's up guys and welcome back to Tasty Planet and in today's episode I don't really know what we're doing or where we're going I was thinking about this when I loaded up the game and that it took us four levels to kind of run train on the scientists lab And we ate their time machine and we went back in time and then we spent four levels eating t-rex ass and chasing dinosaurs around in the prehistoric world But it looks like there's like four or five levels worlds whatever you want to call them left until we get to ancient Egypt so I'm not really sure what we're gonna be doing. I mean, maybe we're, maybe we're gonna do more dinosaur stuff? I have no idea, I'm eager to find out. Oh! Okay, so we're gonna, no, oh, I can't go in the water. So I guess we're going to be doing some kind of sea life stuff. Would that make sense? You know, maybe, maybe we went even further back and we're gonna stop life from colonizing the land. That'd be kind of cool. <laughs> Seeing that, that first creature crawl out of the ocean onto land and then having us eat it. That would kind of, oh, or not. <laughs> okay, theory, myth busted. Life has already colonized land as well as rocks. And, um, all right, I guess we're just gonna go back in time and eat a bunch of alpha dons. I was gonna say beach rats. But alpha dons work too. You know what? I want to call them beach rats. We're just gonna eat a bunch of beach rats. There's not a whole lot going on right now. There's just just a bunch of turtles and uh, and some sticks and some rocks. Kind of an uneventful beach. Just a train of alpha dons. We're just gonna keep eating up all these beach rats. Oh, okay. We do have a, a little bit of colonization going on. Ah, who am I kidding? <laughs> this is just turtles going on land. They do that today. I'm just trying to justify the fact that I had a cool theory. Maybe, maybe not. So, I just want to eat turtles. Ah, I love turtles. And I can't go any further over here, so that's really it. Just sticks and turtles. Oh, I can eat turtles, though. I can eat turtles. That's, that's not good. Oh, ooh. Now can I go further over? I see. So we're moving further inland the bigger I get. Very cool. I'm getting real big and green, though. Big and green and mean. Oh, okay, so we're moving back out. So I'm eating boulders now. I'm getting really big at a much faster rate than last episode. I'm in the meters now. Before, it took way longer. We're eating uh, birch trees. Is that what that said? Birch tree? Really? It's kind of cool. Yeah, birch tree. Okay, well then I'll take it. Oh, alligators. Uh, or or dinosuchus. Dinosuchus. Alligator, crocodile, dinosuchus. All the same thing. Oh, man. It's just so satisfying being big enough to, to sweep around and scoop everything up. And oh, nothing stands in my way, no owls. Time taken, three and a half minutes. Total things eaten, a lot. We're just gonna go with a lot. <laughs> I don't really care what I ate, I ate it already. Uh, eat 110 eggs. What? That's different, I need, oh, and look, I don't have a size meter, so I'm not getting any bigger. I just need to go find eggs. What kind of eggs? This is like the world's worst Easter egg hunt. All I'm doing is eating flowers. Okay, okay, I see. We got an angry mama guarding her eggs and we need to eat them. Oh, oh, yeah, you guys know, suckers. They want the eggs too. I see how it is. You guys are stupid. You gotta eat the flowers first, guys. No wonder the dinosaurs went extinct. What idiots. Look at that, they're trying, trying to get those eggs. You guys aren't gonna get those eggs. It's like I said, you need to eat flowers to get bigger first, big and strong. And then I'm gonna probably eat those little dinosaurs, actually. Oh, I can eat the eggs. Oh, sorry, mama. Sorry, mama. Ah, no, not the mama. <laughs> not the mama. Got it. Moving on. Give me all them eggs. Uh, this is all I need to do. Just, just I need to dodge a bunch of dinosaurs and eat a couple hundred eggs. And then I'm gonna eat these guys as well. Maybe I can get to the point where I can eat the mamas. That would be awesome. Oh, oh, I'm getting faster, getting bigger, getting stronger. Exactly what I need. I'm like a million dollar goo. Ooh, just drive by egging. Mine, 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 mine. And I'll take all those and I'll take all of you guys. <laughs> nice. I'm wondering if I don't eat the eggs, if I just eat other stuff, but I keep getting bigger. Like, would I just get huge to the point where... Because the, the level won't end until I finish off all the eggs. I want to see. If I keep eating blue dinosaurs, can I get big enough to eat the brown dinosaurs? Oh, oh, it worked. Yeah, I can eat the mamas now. <laughs> I didn't think that was gonna work. I, I've spent like five minutes just running around eating the little ones. I don't even think I'm supposed to be able to do this. This is awesome. I am huge. I will eat you and then your babies. Okay, so we're gonna eat the eggs. Yeah, you see, that was it. I didn't even need to eat the moms. <laughs> oh, well, it's still cool. 
Okay, this is the final prehistoric level. That makes sense now. So we are at two centimeters and I need to find my way through this boneyard to start off. That's kind of cool, a little bit of a maze. Eventually I'm gonna get big enough to eat this whole maze, screw it all. It's interesting because you can open up little areas that you couldn't have earlier because you're bigger now. This is this is a really, I, I like that they're actually coming up with different ways to use the mechanics of the game. That's something that they really needed to do because if it was just eating stuff for like 50 levels, it'd get a little bit boring. But this is, this is different. Oh, I can get in there now. That's good, if I can eat these, I can eat these. Oh, now I'm gonna get out of hand. Give me all those vertebrae. I gotta go back down and around. Damn maze. Who dies in such an elaborate shape? Like this is, this isn't just one dinosaur. This is many dinosaurs that were like, okay, you know what? Fred, you lie down facing this way and uh, and then rip your arm off and put it over here. You guys, I need all of you to disconnect your vertebrae, put them all in a circle. I'm gonna surround them with my arms and then we're just gonna have everything set. You know, when this goo gets back here, it's gonna have a dandy time figuring his way out through this. In a bit of trouble now, I can't seem to eat anything. Can I eat these skulls? No. Am I missing something? I can't seem to move on. That's not good. There's gotta be something here, right? I'm not, my arrows, ah, here we go. Okay, I can eat these now. Now I can eat the skull. So does that mean I can go back down here? Yes, and then we can eat you, we can eat you, and I saw a bunch of stuff in here for me. Um, nom, 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 nom. Oh, there we go. There we go, now we're making progress. Now we're getting somewhere. Oh, that's so satisfying. The chains that bound me are now my food. That's the threshold I needed to break to start having some more fun. Yeah, give me all these bones. Gonna eat all them bones. And then I don't know if we're gonna, I guess we're gonna get bigger, but are we gonna change times again? Or are there any dinosaurs alive? I'm super confused. <laughs> My guy looks super cute though. Look at look at the little eyes. And he's just like, oh, there's something over there. Blink, blink, blink. <laughs> okay, I think I think we got that. Uh, whoa! Oh, come on. Oh, well, hush my mouth. I was making fun of the game and it all makes sense. They were all the bones inside the tummy of another dinosaur that died. So uh, Fred and all them really, really had no choice in the matter. Yeah, there we go. Time taken, four minutes, total eaten, a lot. Oh, achievement unlocked, peckish. And it's a little goo with a with a fork thing. That's cute, okay. So now, are we, are we done in the prehistoric ages? Are we moving on? No, we're doing more prehistoric stuff. That's so weird. I thought for sure that we had gotten through it and that it would go four at a time. We're still, we're still back here. We're back here eating aphids. We already did this level. I'm getting the feeling that this level is gonna encompass, yeah, everything because we started off really, really small and we were only like a quarter of the way through when we got a little bit bigger. And then we started eating some bigger bugs and now we're eating slightly bigger bugs and, um, and, and like mushrooms and feathers and rocks and stuff like that. And then I'm guessing we're gonna get big enough to start eating these feathered assholes again. So we, this this may be the last one. We're probably gonna encompass everything in this level, which would be cool. You know what? I, I would like to work my way up from eating aphids to uh, eating, you know, the entire prehistoric era. The dinosaurs are such rats. They're all about chasing you until you're finally big enough to eat them and then they run away. It's just, look, look at them. You see how they, oh, there, yeah, where are you guys going? Where, where are you going? Where are you going? That's right. Yeah, I want to hear. I want to hear your feathery screams. Uh oh, we've moved on to trees now, and the dinosaurs are looking more and more like spots. They're just, yeah, they're just bumps in the highway. Okay, so we're back up to eating these massive trees. We're back up to uh, the massive crack in the earth. I like it. So what next? Because we're only, we're only like a quarter of the way through the level. Whoa. Whoa, this is crazy. I'm eating everything. <laughs> I said I was gonna clear cut and I meant it. So we're just gonna shave the earth real clean. I'm 114 meters big, that is crazy. Oh, I can eat the lava. Whoa, that is cool. Why, why can I just scoop up lava? <laughs> All right, so this is getting super out of hand. Oh boy, oh God, I could, I could see, see the curvature of the earth. That is, that is the ocean. I am over the ocean now. Oh, am I gonna eat the whole planet already? I can't, we have so much more to go. That doesn't make any sense. I'm gonna destroy history. Whoa, 
Holy crap. Oh, it's a volcano. Okay, I want to eat the volcano. I can do that. I'll, I'll eat a volcano. You know what? I'm, I'm not beyond that. Am I eating mountains right now? I'm pretty sure I'm eating mountains. They don't... Oh, yeah, they are mountains. Oh, I keep forgetting it gives me the names of what I'm eating down at the bottom. All right, so there's a bunch of mountains. We're just going to clean this up real quick. Maybe we'll uh, sop up a little bit of lava just to wash it down with. Can I eat a volcano? I want, I want you, volcano. I want you. It's going to be mine. <laughs> this is crazy. This is way bigger than I thought you would get. Because we didn't get to this point in the first game. We uh, we just kind of escalated through this and just ate everything. Yeah, there we go. 50 kilometers wide. That is crazy. Bloop. Burp. Oh, I stopped the meteor. So the dinosaurs didn't die. Meanwhile, Doc, where'd all the dinosaurs come from? The goo must have altered the timeline. Dinosaurs never went extinct. Hick. And then poof. And we're in ancient Egypt. Yes, sarcophagus. Achievement unlocked the Cretaceous Crunchies. I like that. <laughs> Should we play one more level? Uh, yeah, those were a little bit repetitive. You know what? I want to see what ancient Egypt is like, just because that's what we're going to be doing next episode. So we're going to be starting off eating some ancient Egyptian maggots, which makes lots of sense. Oh, yeah, look at that. We got all the, like, oh, we got papyrus and we got a bunch of jewelry. Oh, I'm going to eat all your jewelry. That would have been real expensive someday. Yeah, and the scarabs, this is cool. I really like this. I like that, it, like, every episode, hopefully I'm going to be able to kind of change locations now. Because the lab kind of was half a location, I guess you could say. This is awesome. So now I'm on a tabletop, and I'm just running around eating this very rich person's mess by the looks of it. He just has gold and jewelry littered everywhere. Oh, cool. I like that. The uh, sarcophagus mask. Oh, whoops. Did I say table? I, uh, I meant burial slab? I have no idea. I think that's his organs in those, right? Pretty sure those are organs. So we want to eat organs. That's what, that's what we're working up to. We're going to eat all of his necklaces and his uh, uracus. Uraeus? I don't know what that. That's the snake thing. We got an oil lamp. Yeah, canopic jar. So that might have like, uh, like um, presents. You know, donations, that kind of stuff for the afterlife. Most likely has his organs in it. So uh, uh, I guess I don't think we're gonna get big enough to eat him. Oh, I can I can sniff your butt. Ouch. Okay, won't sniff your butt. Fine. See if I care. This guy has no idea what's going on. Spears littered all over the place, and staves, and ancient cats. Oh, oh no! Ah, soldier! Ah, why are you gonna be defending him like that? That's not okay. I'm gonna eat your papyrus. They spent a lot of time working on this, I would imagine. They don't just come off the presses. Come here. You guys said that the last episode the cats have names. I want to see if the cats have names this time. Maybe they have crazy ancient Egyptian names. That'd be cool. Cats. Don't tell me I ate all the cats. There's gotta be, I think there was one down here. Oh, I can eat the guards. Whoops. Nope, just Egyptian Mao or Ma. Hey, buddy. <laughs> Worker. Oh. Hey, we're good. Okay. But that's gonna be it for this episode of Tasty Planet, guys. And I'm looking forward to hitting up all of ancient Egypt. It's gonna be so cool because I feel like we're gonna be able to move on from eating people to like moving through their civilization and eating houses and then eating monuments and then eating like pyramids and stuff like that. Like last time we got to the point where we ate a volcano. So I can only imagine how big we're gonna get in this civilization, but I'm gonna try to format the episodes so that each episode moving forward is gonna have a different theme and I'll cut out the repetitive levels because I noticed in the prehistoric stuff, there were three or four levels that were pretty much just repeats of one another. And that's not really fun to watch. It's fun to play. I can understand why they would put it in the game, but you guys don't wanna see the same thing over and over so I'll try to work it so that it's gonna be a little bit better moving forward that could be my promise to you guys but thank you so much for watching this video I hope you enjoyed and I'll see you next time <gasps> I did it I got there okay sorry chesty lady I, I got no time for you like I said goddesses to save more important fish to fry pew right in the titties oh yeah titties okay no 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 no